Hi everyone, so it's me again. Um, do also check out my other breastfeeding video because you'll see I'm in the same outfit and everything because I'm tackling the other things as I promised. So these are the accessories like I say. So I'll share with you of course my pump. Um, the pump I use which I really like if you saw my favourites video is this pump by Medela. It's a swing pump um, and I guess put it this way, if it's not broke don't fix it really. So I've never really tried another pump, I've, I even have the manual to Medela and I've just not opened it because this just worked so well for me and I'll share with you some of the things I really liked about it. Um, I'll show you some of the accessories as well but firstly it has a, I'm sorry about the noise, sorry. <laughs> So sorry, it has a two-phase step um, where it just lightly stimulates you first and then when it gets to a drawdown phase it does a longer pull on your nipples so it's very efficient I think at you know pumping or extracting the milk. It also has sorry this increase or decrease so you can increase the I guess how hard it's sucking or pulling on your nipples which I really like so you know you can increase it to suit you know your preferences now other things I do like about it is it's just as it's quite small so it's very portable this is the single one as well so it only comes with one you know pump for like one breast at a time but it does come in a dual if you if you prefer that or need that um, the other thing is it has a battery pack at the back which um, it's very good because meaning it comes with an AC adapter yes that you you know you plug in the hose but you can literally just pick it up and um, pump anywhere anywhere that's you know you just need to I've done it in the car really <laughs> uh, or anywhere in your house for instance if you just can't get to a socket or anything so I really like that and it's just like I said so small it's just you know neat and portable it comes with a bag as well so you can put all the accessories um, and carry it around you know really handy um, and I'll share or just show you I guess what the attachments look like um, so this is basically what it is it's a three part this part detaches from this which detaches from that so it's like three pieces and then it has this um, like a hose that connects the hair and then yeah, you just pump away and this part I have no problems it fits nice and comfortably on my boobs on my boobs so yeah I like this the only thing sorry I will add is it's hard to feel like you've cleaned this but it doesn't necessarily get dirty anyway but you know you do want to sterilize things after a time because they can I guess flow back into it um, depending on how you handle the pump but yeah this is just I guess more difficult to clean but they, it, you can sterilize it easily um, so yeah so that's on the pump, which I really like. Now, along with the pump came, I guess, the calm attachment for feeding. Um, so it looks like this, um, which I will say I have no problems with this. But to be honest, my husband doesn't think my son liked this much. He thinks my son preferred the Tommy TP nipples over this uh, because I guess he was the one that was really feeding him out to the bottle to be honest so I guess I kind of have to give him some some points <laughs> but I don't mind it because I fed him with this a few times like when I'm in church or something because it was sometimes just convenient um, I would feed him and he fed well but my son my husband sorry just prefers to use these bottles just so you know um, now the other thing I got so that's the bit on their karma which is supposed to replicate I guess like feeding from the boob just so one thing I should add sorry is I also use these connectors with the pump head because this is this will allow me to pump straight into my Tommy TP bottles the wine net bottles and I got this this was a Tommy TP brand um, and in the UK I found it on a website called fishpond.co.uk because you couldn't find this anywhere really just so you if it helps um, but yeah so this really just slots on here and then it will slot on to your bottle and I would pump with this so handy um, handy um, what you call this attachment um, no I will share with you I guess how I sterilized or some of the options I use for sterilizing which I really liked no I did try their quick clean bags from the same brand actually I got a bundle when I bought this off eBay eBay was really good I got a really nice bundle which gave me um, storage bags some of these I think the pumps uh, well not both pumps um, kind of thing but anyway it just had worked out really well um, so yeah I tried this microwave steve removal bag and it works it has a thing where you kind of just mark off how many uses because you can reuse these and I think for the pump not for the pump for the hose it recommends I guess using the bag because you just 
um, you have to just put enough water just over the hose. Through my research, I've heard that you know they kind of they can warp depending on how you sterilize them. So be careful. Just check out sterilizing the pumps. I guess on the stovetop. I don't think you should. But anyway, I'm not, I'm not sure, I'm not entirely, I can't recall. Because I haven't been pumping in a while. Now, another thing I will share with you is um, these storage milk bags. So I used, where is the other one? Oh, so I also had, like I said, some Medela storage, pump, storage bags. These are ones I re-bought because the ones that came with my bundle actually had a tape. So you would tape it over, where did it go? You would tape it over, you tape the bag over the handle here when you're pumping. And I love those. But I've used them all and I went and I repurchased some. But these actually come with a connector instead. So you'll use this connector with your pump um, to hold it over. And I didn't use these very much to be honest. But because um, you see I still have quite a few left because I stopped pumping. But anyway. Um, but I like the storage bags because they're just easy to store in your fridge. Don't take up as much space as say a bottle. But I also transitioned to using bottles only because it was just I felt like I was always just throwing away the bags and you know save the environment I guess I don't know so I'll show you what I also use in terms of bottles but the other type of um, breast milk storage bags I had were Lantino bags which also worked well just sharing that with you so the Lantino ones are really nice and I had no problems with them and like I said they store nice and flat as you need etc no I did go and purchase this um kit which has where's the bottle I got this kit off um, Amazon in the US. I'm actually in the UK, but I got it off Amazon in the US because I had a friend who brought it for me, really. Um, and it's by Medela. It's kind of, let me just, has a bit of fluff inside. But anyway, I can't really get the fluff off, but it doesn't matter. So it's by Medela. It just has this container here, and it came with uh, six of these bottles. And it came with six of these bottles and you will just see it has an arrow if you can see so in and out you would basically just put them in as you've been feeding and you know uh oh sorry <laughs> as you're feeding and then I'll use the other bottle as you're feeding and then you know it will you'll know which end to take out now this just seems very I guess <laughs> like a <laughs> Um, a glorified I guess storage thing I don't know but to be honest it just really helped just because when I fed when I pumped and I stuck things in the fridge I'd always try to put the most recent pumped bottle to the back and then pulled everything else forward basically but you know because my husband is the one who'd go in to pull out but this way it would just avoid any confusion on which milk to use or which bottle etc to take or even I stick the bags in here as well even though you label things as well but these bottles which I will show you that come in this set actually come with a handy label thing so you can switch it to whatever month whatever day of the week if you can see that clearly I hope and then you just press it down to lock it in and then you can also show indicate if it's a.m. yeah a.m. here middle of the day or p.m. afternoon so like for instance this is now saying this was I pumped Tuesday in the middle of the day so like this about it because then I didn't have to write things and you know after you pump in a bit it just this was nice and easy so this may be a useful option for some um, and then it comes with a tray and it comes with some smaller bottles as well these take up um, less space too so these are um, I think they're 80 mil yeah the only thing I will tell you right I know I brought this is that it has this label where you can mark with the marker now maybe I use the wrong marker I don't know but you see it doesn't really wash off really well so I don't know that's probably something to know just make sure you use the right marker I think I probably just use the wrong marker but it has that feature where you can always label it as you use and then I guess relabel so that was good so that's what helped me with storing milk in the fridge um, also in the freezer when I would have these in the bag I would just try and lay things flat I did get sorry um, a narrow continue to press things so they stay upright and flat but I actually didn't end up using them in the end so I'm giving that away really so but you know as long as you have some mechanism to kind of press them flat so that they don't just um, spread out and take up too much space um, then you know just try and do that really I guess um, the other thing I will mention is what I used um, now for on the go. Um, so to travel with breast milk, you know, I'd carry the milk in the, in a bottle, 
Um, so for instance, like the bottle without the nipple cap on, just with a normal flat cap to cover it. I'd travel with the bottle, you know, in an insulated bag with probably an ice pack and then I'd carry this. Now this is a glorified thermos, right? <laughs> because it's literally, this is by Tommy to Pee, sorry, before I get ahead of myself. But it's literally just a thermos, but it has this handicap and this is what I really like about this because you can just carry a thermos, yes, um, but this gives you, I guess, this cap is what you would put your bottle in and fill with the warm water sorry guys fill with the warm water to warm up your bottle um, no I would put boiling water in this and literally it would keep for hours so it really works well as a thermos and the other thing which is handy for this with this one is the fact that you don't actually have to screw off the top you know yeah you will handle in a baby as well you just literally press down here and then pour and then it back to close it and I've never had any spilling issues or any episodes with this it just it's really worked well so I think it's really well made and it's actually probably only cost me about seven pounds so it wasn't I guess too overpriced either but I love this facility because then it was one thing yes to have your hot water but to always have something to keep this in to keep it warm and then keep your hands from getting hot as well so yeah I like this um, no I will tell you you may wonder as well you know once you put all the water in there you know how do you dispose of it? So if you don't have anywhere to throw it away like happened to me sometimes because I was at church, I would just throw it back in, throw it back into this. So, um, yeah. Now you can also use this, I guess, for if you have formula feeding as well too. So it's just a thermos, I don't know, but you won't necessarily benefit from the cap, so I don't know. But yeah, so this really helped. Um, and this is how I, what I used when I ever had to feed him in public or my husband um, and I had to travel with it. So, yeah. Now, do I have anything else here to share? So, yeah. So, that's basically a bit on the things I use, you know, the accessories, my pumps, um, what I use to help with storing the milk, as well as to travel on the go. Um, so, I hope this was useful. Um, do rate, comment and subscribe and thanks for watching guys. See you in my next video.